38 billion, and it's 130,000 loans from 2,400 lenders, big banks included, a lot of it's community banks. So just to answer your question, let's see what happens. I mean, our job is to execute what we got. So you got assistance going out to 175 million people. I keep using that stat only because, I don't know, for somebody like me who's been around a while, it's unbelievable. Government assistance, 175 million people. It's just a little south of a third of GDP. So our job is to execute. Let's get it out. I, I think we're doing okay, frankly. Uh, I, I know there are always a few glitches, but I think, I mean, I'd give it an A. You might not agree, but whatever. Uh, and if we need more, we'll, 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 we'll ask for more. But let's just sort of day at a time, week at a time. Let's see how this works. We're going to get some lousy numbers coming up. We know this. Uh, we talked about this um, last Friday with the jobs report. Um, I still believe, given our assistance package and hope and maybe prayer that we're in a four to eight week period, we can get a pretty good snapback. Okay, a good snapback. How, that, how that's my hope. That snapback well, it's a you know, the sooner the sooner we begin to reopen, the faster that snapback's going to be. That's the rule of thumb that I think most economists would agree with.